Good morning everyone, it is bright and early and we are headed to the Women's March. I'm so incredibly happy to be a part of it again this year. Um, this is going to be my third, I think my third year and I'm just really pumped to go and support all those powerful women. Very influential day, I can't wait. So here's the scoop, right? It's pure chaos down there as you and I both know. So I think I'm only taking one child and Joe said he can hang with one child and of course he is like a daddy's girl lover. So Penelope will be staying here, Grayson will come with me and we're gonna go support a lot of influential, world changing, inspirational women. We are backstage at the march. Say hi Grayson! Hi, hi, he's shaking his hands. Um, and are you excited to be here supporting all these wonderful women? <laughs> I want to bottle that up. He's so cute. We're going up the steps of City Hall. I'm still learning how to do stairs. They're a little bit harder for little people. Here we go. Good job. You did it. Check out City Hall. And there goes Gray. Where are you going, Grayson? So we just heard word that there are currently 200,000 people marching today. Maybe more, but um, that's the current status. And everybody here is at the stage waiting for the show that is after the march, which is really exciting. is a resistance. We come with demands for justice, for equity. We come today peaceably, but we also come to fight. It is my hope that our coming together today will also be one of healing. Yeah. That this Women's March be a healing space for each and every one of us today. Good morning, Los Angeles. <laughs> Buenos dias, Los Angeles. La primera marcha aquí en Los Ángeles fue la más grande en el país en 2017. Y continuaremos a luchar a nuestras mujeres y nuestros derechos. A woman leads our airport here in Los Angeles. A woman heads up our Department of Transportation. This past year, the first African-American woman became a deputy chief in LAPD, and the first woman to ever graduate at the top of her class as a fire department was a woman. So what do we do moving forward? I have one challenge to everybody out there in conclusion. We need to step up in our boardrooms, in our C-suites, and make sure that women aren't just given lip service, but are given power. Your soul is weary and your bones ache 
for a rest. I think it's brave that you keep on living even if you don't know how to anymore. I think it's brave that you push away the waves rolling in every day and you decide to fight. I know there are days when you feel like giving up, but I think it's brave that you never do by Lana Raffaella. <laughs> Grayson and I totally appreciate it. He's just waking up. Um, I am leaving the Women's March now, but do mind that it is always important to stand up for what you believe in. And I believe in equal rights for everyone, no matter what your size is, your race is, anything. What your, your love preference is, no matter what it is, we should all have equal rights. Right? <sighs> Anyways, until next time, please don't forget to subscribe, click the like button, I hope that you enjoyed. This is my third annual Women's March and I always document them because they mean so much to me. Today's shout out goes to Josie Damore. Thank you so much for your sweet wishes. I adore you being a part of the channel. I love a good Sicilian, more Italian family for me. I hope all of my mama maniacs enjoy this family. There's more to come this year, guys. Bye! Say bye, Grayson.